With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello guys, in this question we are given that there is a room and everybody has to shake hands with everyone else. And the total number of handshakes is 66. Then we have to find the number of persons in that room, right? So, uh, we know that for each handshake, for each handshake, we require two person, right? And let's say the total number of person, total person in that room are n, right? So, uh, the total number of face will be uh, the number of face selecting two, two person out of the n persons, right? So, total base or we can say total handshakes will be equals to nc2 and which is given as 66. So, we can write that nc2 is equals to 66 and c2 is simply n n minus 1 divided by 2 into 1 which is 66 on multiplying we will get n square minus n and on multiplying 2 here we will get 132 or we can say n square minus n minus 132 is equals to 0 this is not nothing but a simple quadratic equation if we factorize it we will get n minus 12 n plus 11 is equals to 0 from here we get n equals to 12 or n equals to 11 minus 11 obviously n equals to minus 11 is not possible because persons can be negative right so n equals to 12 is our answer now if we see in the options uh, option second is the right answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itg and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today